everybody, Jordan Gasly here, and it is October, and I thought, why not go out to another haunt? We did another world, and I'm going to be joined by a friend of mine. You've probably seen him before. Oh, God. Wait, where did you come from? You don't want to know. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> anyway, I'm joined by my buddy Morgan. You guys have seen Morgan in some of my various vlogs. I got a new YouTube channel, though. Now. Yeah, man, plug away. Changed it up. It's Tiki Goon. Tiki, Tiki with two E's instead of an I. Tiki Goon Morgan. He'll post it. It'll be. Yeah, link in the description. So Morgan and I thought we would have uh, a nice spooky time. Meet up, hang out. It's been Actually, a minute. It has been a minute. Like we had, I don't think we've hung out since this whole thing has started. Uh, AEW. AEW. That's right. That was before all this started. Uh, that was so. That was in February. February. Wow. Anyway. So Maury and I are going to go and we're going to check out a little local haunt here in Ackworth, Georgia called Folklore Haunted House. Now for years I've been hearing about this haunted house and I haven't had a chance to check it out, but I keep hearing that they knock it out of the park. So I, along with Morgan, we're going to go get scared. Morgan might poop himself. Probably. Oh, my mask back on. <laughs> That's how frightening I am. <laughs> <laughs> scared you right out of your mask. All right, let's go check it out. And that is our destination. It's a building right along this back road in Ackworth, Georgia. Yeah, this parking lot's pretty spooky. You think you think something will jump out and scare us here in the parking lot? Not me. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> All right, so as a safety precaution, they're doing temperature checks, which I think is a smart move to do. I agree. In, in quasi-large gatherings. And that's where we're headed. Morgan is restarting his vlog, so he's back over here doing his thing. So, I'm gonna go vlog Obama. I'm gonna, hold on. I'm gonna. Now he sees me, he knows what he's doing. Nope. Nope. I don't. Making everyone else sick. Alright, so there's two haunts here at Folklore Haunted House. One is called The Manor, and one is called Asylum. So, I'm assuming that The Manor is probably more of a. Like a haunted, an actual haunted house type theme, like ghosts and whatnot. An asylum might be a little bit more of a, like a freaky, insane asylum, maybe? Sanitarium? Con context clues. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I went to college. Look at you. We went to college together. We did. We were in the same class. <laughs> Shout out to Dr. Mueller. <laughs> right? <laughs> um, which one do you want to start with? Let's start with this. I, th I say let's start with the site. Okay. Because manor sounds cool. What's going on over there? Oh, there's like games and stuff over there. Yeah, I'm gonna play. Do you wanna do you wanna go walk over there for a second? Sure. Alright. I'm gonna do like There's like a couple of spooky carnival games out here. I think Morgan's gonna play. Morgan just bought some tickets and he's about to lose. 100 percent Yeah, well I, everybody remembers Rob not getting that brain. I still feel bad. You should okay. feel bad. And that was like three years ago. I it's want you to feel bad. I mean, Rob is still dead because he did not have his brain. I don't think I would have helped. I mean, well, not with that attitude. <laughs> Knock down two, get a bracelet. Knock down three, get a cup. I got six throws. Let's we'll see what happens. All right, we're going to go for Beetlejuice first. Missed it. Oh, man. Let's try it again. Missed again. I'm not looking too good, guys. All right. Woo! Third time's a charm. Much like you have to say Beetlejuice's name three times. Maybe that's why I missed twice. Let's go for Pennywise this time. Let's do it. All right. First try. Mr. Pennywise here. Missed. Uh. And Pennywise again. Oh, I missed. I only got two out of six. Well. Not great. Oh well. Listen. But I got a wristband. Oh, look at that. So in look someone's heart, I'm a winner. Let's see. Is there anything on it? Yeah. 
Does it glow oh. in the dark? It says Folklore Haunted House on it. Oh, look at that. And it probably glows in the dark. What is going on over here? I don't, I, listen, this is the building where we're going, but I don't like the fact that there's no lights. It's like even more ominous. Like we're already on a back road. Yeah, well, here we go. There's some uh, hand sanitizer right here. All right, so we're in the queue now. So as always, I won't be allowed to film inside the haunt. But once we're done through this one, Morgan and I will pop out, get on the camera, and kind of tell you our immediate thoughts of well, how we thought the haunt was. <laughs> that is a lot better. I have figured out the low light setting on my camera. I've only had this camera for a year and a half. You've had it that long already? I've had it that long already. And you just figured this out? Just, just now. I went to college. All right, so Morgan and I just finished Asylum, the Asylum haunt, and I thought for what it, for what it is, made it so. Uh, keep in mind again, this is a, a much smaller haunt Correct. Uh, than the Netherworld. Netherworld is a very big budget, big warehouse haunted house. So again, a little bit of a smaller haunted house, and I those kids are real scared. They, they some two kids just took off running that way. Uh, but I thought the scares were really good. I actually got scared a handful of times, like probably like four or five, maybe even six times. I uh, six, uh, six and a half. I'll, I'll let it. I'll let it slide, since you know I don't want to embarrass you on your. Hold channel. on, no, hold on. This dude was like ten feet ahead of me, and he threw me to the werewolves, literal werewolves, hey. in the haunt. You gotta do what you gotta do. Hey, you know I I, I cannot fault you for that, <laughs> but. I took the brunt of the scares. You know what? Just for you, this next house, I'll bring up the room. All right, all right, excellent. You heard it here. <laughs> but no, I, I, I enjoyed it. I thought it was solid. Yeah. Um, so far, my only concern throughout the entire haunt is the queue leading into the haunt. Social distancing has not been existent. Yeah, it's, it's kind of little to none. I will say the people behind us were actually very nice and they did keep their distance. Right. And we tried to keep our distance from the group in front, of us. Group in front of us. But as far as everyone else... Uh, it's real tight. Yeah, it, it is It is a little tighter than I, I want it to be, but I I don't feel uncomfortable, but it should be a, enforced a little bit more, I think. I would agree. Um, but everybody is wearing a mask. And I have I've only seen like one, maybe two people just wearing it under the nose. But so far, as far as the the mask uh, the rule, everybody's been doing great. So I think we are going to go now and get in line for asylum. Nope. No. Manor. Manor. Because we did asylum. Yeah. yeah. Asylum is that way. Manor's so that way. manor's that way. All right. Let's go do it. <laughs> All right, so slight change of plans. Uh, Morgan and I didn't really feel comfortable waiting in this this line that's like, where social distancing hasn't really been enforced. Uh, so we paid an extra eight dollars to upgrade for a fast pass ticket. So uh, normally it's something I wouldn't do, but I think in this case it's probably well justified. So we're gonna use this and hopefully uh, bypass probably uh, an almost an hour wait. It looks like At minimum. Yeah. I I would argue there's about 500 people standing over there. All right, there's there's a lot. There is a lot. So we're gonna go and do this now. We'll see you on the other side. Oh, hey, there we are. Okay, so we just did the manor, and like we said, we ended up buying the eight dollar fast pass. That was so unbelievably worth. It. Yes, because we were pretty much in and out. Yeah. So like I think. It was a total of maybe 20, 25 minutes since we recorded that last clip. But, uh, Manor was uh, was creepy and scary. It didn't have as many of the jump scares as Asylum had. Correct. Uh, perhaps it was just our place in line because the people ahead of us weren't moving as uh, at a quicker pace. And the people behind us were moving at a very rapid yes. pace. So we were in this weird, awkward position. But, as far as like the uh, the aesthetic of the, of the trail or the haunt, uh, it was great. And something that's very interesting is 
This entire building houses two haunts, and they both use the same exit. We didn't realize that, so whenever right. I said, uh, I can't remember if it was on my video or your video, where I said, like, uh, like the, the asylum turns into this weird catacomb-like aesthetic. Um, it turns out that that's just the exit, the exit trail to get out. So they, the exits of both of these things kind of converge at one point, and then you just kind of have to get the heck out of the building. So, well, what did you think, Morgan? I th did it feel shorter? It felt a little shorter. Okay, it felt I a little shorter. Um, I think the set pieces were were very very good. I mean, mm -hmm. I think those set pieces were on par with a, a Netherworld style haunt. Yeah. Um, it was short, and yeah, you're right. Not not that many jump scares. Yeah, but I did. As far as like because we didn't get as many jump scares. There were some scare actors in there that did interact with you a little bit more. Correct. Like I, I had a stare down with somebody in this weird uh, coffin room. Yeah. And it was like for a good like minute, I thought. Yeah, and yeah, so I thought that while. thought it like added some pretty cool tension. These people over here are yelling as they drive. Um, yeah. So I thought that kind of added like a nice like like tense tense uh, like I guess feeling or ominous feeling to to the haunt. Yeah. Um, Still didn't social distance in there, which yeah. uh, I'm gonna pop an extra vitamin C in hopes. Four, it, three. Yeah, just in case, just in case. They've got a line of Folklore Haunted House t-shirts and other things like hoodies and underwear and skeletons with beanies and masks. I feel like the only thing this place is missing is a giant green goblin cutout. Excuse me, sir, a moment of your time. Moment of, I would just like to say I love what you've done with the place. It looks great. I, hi there. How are you? Are you doing? Strong silent type, it's okay, I get it. So, I, you know, there's a nurse in one of these buildings that I think can help you out with, with that. So, um, you know what? I don't want to waste any more of your time, so I'm just going to go this way. And uh, I'll see you later. Thank you. So I think that's going to do it for us. Uh, here at the Folklore Haunted House here in Ackworth, Georgia. I really enjoyed myself. Morgan, how about yourself? I thoroughly enjoyed myself. I always like hanging out with you when you get scared. Yep. Always a good time. Yep. Um, but haunted houses wise, I think, you know, if you are if you like haunted houses and you want to get scared, Folklore is a great place. Out, literally outside of the, the social di distancing, I thoroughly enjoyed my night. Yeah, it was really fun. I, I, I'm going to be back next year for sure. This is actually not too far of a drive from where I live. So, and uh, I'm really happy that I actually made the trek here yeah. to, to finally to finally experience it. So I think that's going to do it for us. I've already said that, but I'm saying it again. Uh, it's going to do it for us tonight. If this is your first time here, uh, thanks for watching. You could have watched any of the number of videos on YouTube, but you chose to watch this one, and I really appreciate it. It means a lot to me. And after you're done watching this one, go watch mine. Yeah, I'll link, link Morgan's stuff either in a corner or I'll put it down in the description below. Uh, but if you like what you saw, go ahead and hit like. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Hang around. I've got other videos coming out. It is the spooky season. I do have some other <laughs> Halloween type stuff coming out. But uh, go ahead and uh, subscribe. And uh, if you like it, tell your friends. More the merrier, I say. So until next time, we'll see you real soon. Stay spooky. <laughs>